the Utah Division of Wildlife Resources conducted its annual spring survey at King County's Navajo Lake, as aquatics biologist Michaela Roundy explains. So each year we come and do a, a population survey to see what the fish are looking like for the year and if we need to adjust our stocking or if there's a new species that showed up or, or just see how everything is going. So that's why we're here today. For gill netting, we come out in the afternoon. Like yesterday, we came out about three o'clock and set the nets. Um, well, the idea is that they'll fish the evening when fish are active in the evening and then the morning. We'll come and pull them in and see what we got. The high altitude lake is home to various fish species like tiger muskies, splake, and rainbow trout, which are stocked by the division. Additionally, it's home to Utah chub, which Roundy said is undesirable, so the division is working to reduce their numbers. Once pulled aboard, the surviving desirable fish are weighed and measured before being released. The rest are taken to shore for further processing. For more, read the full story online. This is Alicia Lundgren reporting for Cedar City News, your number one source for local news.